Welcome back to East Texas Live here on KTK, and it's a great day to be learning. The Sylvan Learning Center has brought some pretty cool, I, I, I call them projects in the break. Are they projects? Yes, or, science or just projects. Science, science projects. Yes. That's what they were called yes. back in the day. It's been a while. Uh, <laughs> so, all right, so okay. explain a little bit about what you guys have brought here today. Okay, so the first activity we have uh, has to do with pumpkins because it's that time of year. Uh, do a, uh, families are doing a lot of pumpkin carving. Right. And so we have a little bit uh, uh, educational educational view on pumpkin carving. So, do you remember doing a geo board in school? It's it's been a while. You uh, put like the rubber bands around it and make the shape. Right, right, right yeah. yeah. So we're implementing that in our pumpkin. Oh my goodness. So what we've done is was we've uh, created the um, you know the pumpkin's face. Right. And then also after you're done putting all the stuff on there, and then you put. Um, you put your rubber bands around it. You can take a pen or a sharpie, and right. you can trace around it, and then you can cut your pumpkin. Cut the out. pumpkin that yeah, way. Carbon. That way, it doesn't. Uh, mine never come out great. So that's, <laughs> that's the easy way to do it. Right. So just do it that right. way. Also, a fun thing to do is um, some kids might have never done this before. Right. So you can make predictions about what's going to be inside it, how it's going to feel, how many seeds might be in there, do it that um, way. how much it weighs, and take measurements and stuff like that. There's there's so much that you don't really think about. Oh, you can learn from so many yeah, different things. Yes. Taking a fun activity such as carving a pumpkin. Right. All right. So uh, this right here is drawn mine. Whenever y'all brought yes. it in. Okay. So we have a fun little activity that you can do. Very inexpensive. You just need uh, water and food coloring and oil. Okay? okay. So we're gonna make almost like a lava effect. We also have Alka Seltzers that we're gonna let you give yeah. it a shot. Oh, we're gonna let you okay. do the science project. All right. Yeah. Uh, okay. So just drop them in. All right, just drop them in. It's not drop gonna, in. Okay. Yes, yes. And right. then, and Ooh. then in about three seconds, yeah, we're gonna see some changes. Oh, so wow. the oil and the water they never actually mix together. Um, so it makes this really cool lava. And we have our dancing spiders for how dancing spiders up at the yes, top. It's there's very spiders festive. in there. Yes. So you yeah. could put whatever. We'll move it out here so people can see yeah. how awesome yes. this is. If we can't. <laughs> Look at that. Look at how cool that is. <laughs> yes. So uh, you could be creative at home on what things you might want to dance in there. Okay. So and, really fun. and for, I guess, you know, teachers or even parents to be able to bond with their kids over this, how important is it to just take something that you wouldn't think, oh, you can learn from like pumpkin carving or even something cool like this? How important is that to engage a young person's mind? I mean, it's super important because uh, kids are very curious. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, whatever you can do educationally behind anything is really good because you want them to um, just have those critical thinking skills right. and you really do learn everything you learn in school. I mean, you use everything you learn in school outside exactly. in the real world. Yeah. And I wish I would have retained it so I would have <laughs> been able to say, yes, I know science projects. So right. you guys also have, I want to pop up the graphic too, the homework monster. Explain yeah. that. So this time of the year, uh, you've probably got your first homework, uh, I mean, your first progress report or um, the first six to nine weeks has been completed. Right. So in our families, they have uh, started having this, what we call the homework monster. So kids are being frustrated with their parents. Parents might not know how to teach um, the new way of teaching. Right. So uh, right now, we're offering a free hour of homework support yes. at Sylvan. So we're offering a free hour for the whole month of October. Parents can come in, um, have their kids sit down with a tutor, mm -hmm. and um, get the free hour um, of homework support with us. Kind of one -on -one. One? Yeah, Great. and so they can come in, the kid can meet with the tutor, and then also we'll have our parents meet with our director, and then the director can fill them in on everything that, that we do to, need to, to yeah. Need to do. All right, yeah. so real quick, uh, if people want to find out more information, where can they go? So they can go to sylvanlearning.com, and then also if they want to take advantage of this um, free homework hour, mm -hmm. they can call the 903-597-2535. Okay, yes. well, thank you guys so much for yes. coming on. And bringing science projects, it's fun. <laughs> Up next, costly mistakes for cash.